He heard your joke. He he likes it. Laughing. He is. He's having a good time. Yeah. Everything's always prepared to just have a good time. I don't see him laugh a lot, but he I mean, can. It's a, he seems like a cool dude. Better right. player. Awesome. I think it's real nice guy. Immediate footstool coming out from Murr. Yeah. Okay. Up, he's going up for early. Gonna see a little bit of a combo game going, but drops it kind of early. I mean, when you go from the last match to this one, you can just see like there's a, there's almost a completely different level of movement going on. Yeah, yeah, for sure. The thing with Mario is that he has such different movement for a lot of from a lot of the other top player or the top characters in the game. Oh. He's not connected with that up air, but that down air will tries for another one, but gets trade with the up B. Okay, forward throws knock into the trick. Of course, not quite yet, at least. That neutraler will take Mer's name away from him, though. Thirty-three percent right now on him already. I did not even know Nair was a killing move. Oh yeah. Most of the time it is used for edge guards against Mac, but apparently it also kills whenever it's way out there. Just about anything will kill though. Oh. <laughs> when you're when you're inside the blast zone, you're dead. <laughs> it doesn't matter if it just has a set knockback. You're just gone. Yeah. Uh oh. We see Wish Time come out. Oh, down air. Smash? Oh. No down air. Yeah, no. Oh, unfortunately, a big miss on that down air. That's still oh. the game though. A quick two stock coming out here from you. And at, wow. the, and at the very end, just walked up to him, which time right in his face, like, hey. Yep. He said, I'm here. So, Erling missed out on that down air kill, spiking Mert into the stage. But, uh, he's, he's still he's still got the game at, uh, shortly after, so it's still good on Erling. Mm -hmm. he's, still, he's still jamming and grooving. We're going to go to Battlefield. So... This will be an interesting game. Mario likes Battlefield, can extend his up air combos. Bayonetta really doesn't care for it. Because uh, she doesn't really doesn't really use platform smash in her combos. Because she can do up B then jump and up B. The thing is though, is that off this top battlefield platform that you're gonna die so early, not quite early enough though for the airline. But it's such a high ceiling, it's so hard to kill with Bayonetta from the from the ground. That's why she doesn't really like it too much. Okay. Well, both of these players' ability to uh, convert off of basically anything. Yeah. I mean, Murray's definitely going to be looking for some down throws. He's going to be looking for some uh, for some up tilt stuff like that. And Airlink's looking for exactly what he keeps getting. He's, he's just looking and hunting for these nares and these uppies, and he's getting both. And that's going to be a stock taken away. A fully charged S match will do the trick. 77% on Airlink, so Murray's doing better this game. He's already adapted at least a little bit. Stage also helps, I, I feel. Oh, true. But he's playing much better than he did the last game. So this last game was a warm-up game, homie. Yeah. Spare, spare me one more. We'll, I'll take you to game three. And if oh. there's anyone that was going to take uh, Airlink to game three, I believe it would be Murr. Yeah, definitely. Especially right now, Murr is looking very good, but 40%, 48%. You want to get the stock off, 20% of go against Bayonetta. But instead, Airlink, oh, does not connect those double side Bs. We're looking for an edge guard. Mm -hmm. Yep, the side B falling out of it with an air. Airlink can be, be playing a little bit more patient by these legends whenever he can. 141% though, throws out the neutral B, or the neutral air, rather, sorry. Um, just try, try to get some percent on Murr. Uh-oh. Oh, he's going to be carried off the top, and that's going to be the game. 2-0 to Murr, and gets double two-stock. Airlink says, I'm not going to miss, I'm not going to lose one stock in this set. And then he doesn't. Airlink is, uh, Airlink's kind of a monster. We were talking about quotas before. Airlink is very tight with, uh, Airlink is very tight with, uh, with the stocks he gives out. <laughs> Actually, he doesn't give out any at all. Yeah. You have to take them from him. Airlink's kind of a monster. For sure. The man is crazy. Yeah. So he's really good at this game. He's really, really good at Smash 4. <laughs> Can we just... No, I'm not going to say that. But, yeah, definitely a very talented player. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, right now... We have Calm, Animal, and Say up, so 
These two, uh, I helped with the seeding a little bit, tried to help with these two. Um, Zay and Common Animal, they're number two and three, Zay number two and Common Animal being number three on the seeding. Oh man, um, very, uh, very strong player. I mean... Yeah, incredibly so. The Bowser? Yeah, I... Big boy. The, the first time I ever saw him was last week, and he, he made it all the way to Grand Finals. Sure got 3 0 by Aerolink, but Aerolink is not a player to be slept on. Yeah, no, obviously not, yeah. Definitely one of the top 10 in DFW, pretty much undisputed. Mm -hmm. um, he's definitely uh, within... he's probably top 5. I would say he's top 5. I don't know who's ranked above him right now, if Jason or him's higher. But I believe one of them's four and the other one's at five. So they're both so Aerolink 